I'm Jerry Reynolds, the car pro with another edition of the automotive news in two minutes. A fiery investigation has the potential to lead to one of the largest vehicle recalls in history. The investigation centers on three older Jeep models and whether there's a risk of fire after rear end collisions. The vehicles being investigated are the 93 to 2004 Jeep Grand Cherokees, the 93 to 2001 Jeep Cherokee, and the 2002 to 2007 Jeep Liberty. All told, the investigation includes some 5.1 million vehicles. The action being taken by the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration is short of a recall, but has the possibility to lead to one. Now, Jeep insists there's no defect and no safety risk. The older Jeep models had their fuel tanks behind the rear axle. Jeep moved the Grand Cherokee's tank in front of the rear axle in 2005, so the newer versions are not part of the investigation. Well, in fact, the only thing you're going to want to watch out for with this new Jeep Grand Cherokee SRT8 is a speeding ticket. If you want a sports car but need an SUV, this 2012 Jeep Grand Cherokee SRT8 might be the vehicle for you. This 5,200-pound four-wheel drive SUV has got a 6.4-liter Hemi under the hood that's putting out 470 horses. Zero to 60 time is just 4.6 seconds. Besides being super fast, this Jeep handles great and has a wonderful leather and suede interior with heated and cooled front seats. In the media center, you've got navigation system, Bluetooth hookup, and an 825 watt stereo with 19 speakers inside. This model also has a DVD player with wireless headphones and a rear view camera. Some other cool features on the Grand Cherokee include adaptive cruise control, blind spot monitoring system, power lift gate, and frontal collision avoidance system. Besides being one of the fastest SUVs on the road, this Jeep is quite comfortable and it has a lot of cargo area in the back, although it doesn't have a third row seat. As equipped, this Jeep has an MSRP of a little over $65,000, but this could be the answer for couples who need an SUV during the week but want a performance vehicle on the weekend. It rivals the performance of the Porsche Cayenne and the BMW X5. Let's just say it'll pass everything on the road except a gas station. Gas mileage on this beast is 12 in the city, 18 on the highway, but honestly, to get those kind of numbers, you won't be driving this vehicle the way it's supposed to be driven. Catch me on the radio Saturday in Dallas, Fort Worth, Houston, San Antonio, Austin, Los Angeles, Sacramento, Lubbock, Phoenix, and San Francisco. Check the website carproshow.com for showtimes and details. I'm Jerry the Car Pro. Have a great week.